guys, welcome back to Noble Garage. So we finally got some good weather here and I got new rims for the wagon. So let's back it out and put them on now. Okay guys, so here's the wheels that we're going to be running. These are NK RF1 rims and then they're wrapped in Potenza RE71R tires. So and I went with a 215 45 17. So these should be super sticky. We won't be having uh, spinning issues with these. So I'm going to get them on the car now, see how they look. so I got them all mounted up they look great just went out for a drive too to test them out they grip up really nice I wasn't able to break the front tires loose at all I think the fitment's pretty spot on too. It's pretty flush with the, the wheel's a bit turned right now, but it's pretty flush with the fender. And then for the back, I have a, a half inch spacer for these to get it just a little wider in the back. And then it should be pretty square all around. All right guys, it's finally the day. We're gonna start wrapping. We just washed the car. We're gonna start with the fenders, see how those go, and then see how much we get done today. Just opened the wrap for the first time, so I'll show you the color now. So this is a Lamborghini gray color. Um, I won't even try and pronounce it because I'm going to do it wrong. I'll, uh, maybe it's on the box here. It's not. I'll put it on the screen what to uh, the color code is for this. This is a Vivid Premium Wrap. So we're gonna get the fender all prepped and then I'll show you it after it's wrapped. Okay, so we've prepped this side. We took the bumper off, um, undid all the screws for the fender. We've already taken the fender off, cleaned it all up. So we're gonna wrap it with it on the car and then take it off to tuck and finish the edges. So I'm going to time lapse that procedure and I'll show you how it turns out afterwards. Okay, so it's been a little while since I filmed last. It's actually probably been about over a month since I filmed. As you saw last time, finished up wrapping this panel. Since then, we also wrapped the other side. And 
And we got the, the roof and the spoiler here wrapped. So that turned out pretty good. Wrapping's really hard. Gotta give credit to the guys who do that for a living. But for now, I'm kind of sick of wrapping, so probably just slowly pick away at it and finish the rest of the panels. But that's the nice thing is that unlike paint, I can do that. So what else have I done in the last month? I'll uh, give you a look inside the car and show you a couple things. So one thing I did was get this boost gauge mounted. This is just out of a Cobalt SS. Now what I was going to do was 3D print a new vent with a mount for it. I'll put a video of that on screen now. But uh, what I decided was that was a bit too much work and I just went with this route. I just cut away the fins and glued it in there. So looks pretty good. I'm happy with it. And then the other thing I did was finish the signal conversion. So under the dash here I have the Arduino and the two ELM chips that do the signal conversion. So I can start it up. I'll show you that the tack and everything works. Now I need to fix the code because it does take a minute for it to actually first register. But you can see, yeah, there it is. So just need to fix up the code a little bit. Okay, so what's next for the car at this point? I haven't been working on it a whole lot. I've just been really trying to enjoy it this fall and just trying to get the most use out of it as I can. I've gone to a autocross event with it. That was really good. Car performed great. I've also taken it to the Toronto Motorsports Park. Ran around the track there. No issues. The car was handled awesome. It was a great time. So what's next for the car? Next week or two here, I'm going to take it to the dyno, get a baseline power number, and then over the next couple of weeks, I'm going to be installing the stage three kit for the engine and upping the boost. So, just washed the car up along with my coupe. That's all for this time, guys. See you next time. Take it easy.